guys read the article? It revealed my hometown. I don't think people know, but um, yeah, I grew up in Moses Lake, Washington. I've never, ever, ever publicly said it before, but it's pretty out there now. Yeah, my hometown is super small. Super small. It's, it's three hours from Seattle and like an hour and a half from Spokane. Yeah. It was a pretty, it was a pretty good article, I think. I mean, it's whatever. It's not like I'm ever going to live there ever again in my life. I will never, ever, 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 ever live in Moses Lake again. Ever. Never. I will never go back. Never. Unless I have to, but I won't. It's the most boring hometown of life. It's literally... Ever, never, ever, ever living there again. Ever, 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 ever. Wenatchee, Royal City. Yeah, they, okay. Th the only reason why I've, I was ever in Wenatchee or Royal City was for sports. Play tennis. <laughs> that was about it. <laughs> I went to Seattle a lot and I went to Spokane a lot and that was about it. Yeah, ever, ever, ever. It was just very, the only thing Moses Lake had was, uh, I think I think it's called the sand dunes. It's like, you live on a swamp. Or there's a lake. Moses Lake. There's a lake. And, and, and then there's a lake, and then that's about it. Dirt. It's very flat. There's no, there's no skyscrapers or anything. It's just, everything is one story buildings. Very flat. Flat place. 